Hey everybody, welcome to episode one of Stardew Crossing. Uh, we have finally begun. If you have not seen the whole entire island, uh, there will be a link to the previous video touring the whole island showing how this is Stardew Valley x Animal Crossing all in one. In today's episode, we are going to be making something called the orchard or a specific spot of trees where we can sell our fruits because this is Stardew Valley after all and we're going to need a very nice spot to plant our trees. I might have to visit other islands, dig holes, and transfer trees. So this, this is going to be a good one, folks. So for step one, I'm going to have to make about one, two, three, four, five signs to represent five of the fruits that I'm going to have. So we're going to go ahead in the crafting menu and we're going to go to the plain wooden shop sign. This is the really fancy one you see that people use. I'm going to go ahead and craft five of these. We're going to go ahead and customize peaches for this one. Okay, here's the cherries. Next up is the pears. Then the oranges. And last but not least, the apples. And the really cool thing about these signs is that they come in three different colors. You got a nice natural wood color. You got a beautiful white color if you're going for an extra... I don't know, pristine kind of theme. And then you got the nice dark wood, which is like really grungy kind of style here. And then you can add your little custom signs to it. I'm going to go with the uh, original wood for all of these, the natural wood. So we're going to go ahead, use those apples. And we have all our signs ready to go for our orchard. These are all the custom signs that I got. I'm going to just show the, key, the, the codes to get them on the screen right now. So you can go ahead and if you want to copy these, just snag them. Okay, fantastic. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to expand the fence all the way out to the end so we can properly make our orchard. So I'm just going to break down this fence over here. We're going to spread out the ground a little. And we're going to start digging our holes for the orchard. And we'll see how that goes. Bada bing, bada boom. We have now extended out the dirt further out. We have pushed the fences. We've kept this little pathway or a incline in the future to continue on to that part of the island. I have dug up tons of holes over here for the various different trees, as you can see, determined by this awesome little station of fruit on what to do. So I, I set it up in a way that it's like a farm because we ship out products and nothing says shipping out products like boxes, cardboard boxes. So I have a cherry one that I just found in my inventory. I have two orange ones that was being sold at Nook's Cranny. I cannot find the other boxes right now. So I might have to check in with some friends or, or look online. And let me know if you guys have it down in the comments below. But yeah, I threw some fruits on here as well. You know, through the cherry, the orange, the peach, the apple. I put the apple on a barrel. I thought that was different to just change up the whole box thing. And the pear. So what I'm going to do is run around the island, uh, uproot some trees, plant them in their correct sections. I've got this pathway that I just saw. I'm going to throw up the code right now. Ooh, that's nice. Ooh, I like that. Yay, all the pathways are done. Now we got to get the trees. Grabbing some trees around the island. All the trees are now planted into this area. Uh, bon Bon is already going to go pick some fruits. This is fantastic. Ch take a look at this. This is coming out pretty well. Yeah, look at that. Ooh. Perfect pattern. And it's just enough so you can walk through all of the trees. I like it. I think it came out pretty good. Peaches, orange, pears, cherries. And I really like the, the touch of the boxes and the fruits. So it just looks like, yeah, these are the sections to get the stuff. Came out really nice. I think some detail that we could add probably is, you know, some decoration on the sides. We can enhance that later as time goes on and we find the right tools. Definitely, we should probably start working on this area now. We should make some stands here. And I think we can complete the basic idea of the orchard slash shipping area or market for the fruit stuff the fruit market there we go that's what i wanted to do a fruit market so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go ahead and throw another log bench over here
We'll, we'll drop the log round table dead center. All right, that, that kind of, yeah, that kind of looks good. A log stool. Okay. Yep, that's, we can walk around that. And I think the final touch would probably be to get some flowers. And I got some just chilling on the beach. It is now time for the final touch to the area. AKA this beautiful signpost that says trees this way or fruits are this way. So let me, let me show off this little area we just did. So it doesn't seem too bland, right? As you come up here now, you are entering a little market area where fruits are being sold at the stalls. You know, we got boxes of oranges ready to be shipped. We got to sell some, uh, we got a fruit smoothie over here. A little orange, you know, a little weed clump. I have no idea why I threw that. We planted a little, uh, a couple of, uh, white flowers over here, you know, just to add a little touch. We put some log tables in the center with some, uh, beautiful grass root plant design. We have a log stump here to sit down on, you know, if you just want to enjoy the farm. We also have a natural wood log if you just want to sit here. It, it kind of blends in, gives it a kind of a nice look. And yeah, I think it looks fantastic. We had the sign showing off the, the, the area to go into the farm. We have all the fruit signs, which show the exact fruits. We got the boxes, like we mentioned before, which look fantastic. And here is our orchard. Beautiful, ready to go. We got, uh, we got, we got people just chilling over here. Bon Bon, we got the camel. Everyone's having a great time. This orchard came out lovely i feel like we're gonna add some more details to this area as time goes on but yeah that that is it ladies and gentlemen that is today's episode of stardew crossing where we have created the the beautiful orchard if you guys have any suggestions on what to do what to add how can we make it look better feel free to leave them down in the comments below and i will see you guys for sure in the next episode Take care and have a fantastic day. This is Philly Beats You. Bye. Goodbye. Wait, let me do the emote and say bye. There we go. Goodbye.